Performing an avolar or palmar glide of the radial carpal joint, we will grab with our proximal hand the distal radius and ulna, taking a little bit of skin with us, giving us that sharp hay look. With our distal hand, we'll be grabbing the proximal row of carpal bones, squeezing the carpal bones together with a lumbrical grip like this. With my extra fingers, I will pull her up into as much wrist extension as she has. And then to perform a grades three and four, I will perform a, an anterior glide. Grab a little extra skin, creating that Sharpe look. Lifting her up into as much extension as she has. Squeeze to the carpal bones together, give a grade one distraction, and then an anterior or volar glide. 